Dear Pennies and Pens, it's your girl, Lau Pen, CEO of ISLP, the Ink Spot LLC. Today's video is called Beauty and the Pen Unboxing K Beauty Products. So first of all, let me say thanks so much for watching, checking out the Penny Black YouTube channel, and supporting my business, ISLP, the Ink Spot LLC which is a creative production company and multicultural creative agency. That's just a long-winded fancy way of saying that we create our own original products like Pennies and Pens, which is our vegan fashion brand. And I'm wearing one of our 100% uh, organic cotton t-shirts right now. Um, I'm here for the crown, not the prince. Hashtag Queen Inc. because we're empowered pennies and pens and we don't need nobody to hold us down. We only need ourselves. So I'm here for the crown, not the prince. Okay. Just hashtag Queen Inc. and all that. So anyways, you can get one of these really cool original, uh, or original and organic cotton. Ugh. Drop my remote. Pennies and pens. Let me get my life together. I don't ever have my life together in none of my videos. Anyways, you can get one of these really cool, original, 100% organic cotton t-shirts created by a black and woman-owned business on my website, islpdtx.com. So let's go ahead and get started with today's video. We're gonna be unboxing some K-Beauty products. So as you guys know, I am a huge K-pop fan and being a K-pop fan has also led me to be into other aspects of Korean culture such as K-beauty. And so I exclusively use K-beauty products plus uh, products that I make myself on my skin for my skincare routine. And so I was pretty much like out of a lot of products. So I did a whole uh, k beauty product haul from beauty net korea which is um an online obviously a uh, website and retailer that sells k beauty products and so i like them because you can get uh, k beauty products for the low low and so you know pennies i was trying to save them pennies so um i buy both most of my uh, k beauty products exclusively from there and so um, i'm going to korea next month but I was like that low. Like I literally was like, I had no toner y'all. And you know, toner is everything to your skincare routine. So I was like, little baby, I better go on Beauty Net Korea and order me some new products because I cannot wait a whole month and a half because I'm not scheduled to leave for Korea until May 11th and it's not even April yet. So anyways, I'm just gonna go through all the products one by one. This is um, basically what I did was I ordered the products um, from Beauty Net Korea and then I had them shipped to Delivered Korea, which is a free package forwarding service that I use. Um, so I ship all my products uh, there to Delivered and then what I do is I group them together with other packages um, and then get them all shipped together to me to the US. So in this Delivered Korea package box, it's like a bunch of different products. It's all of my products from Beauty Net Korea, plus two other uh, K-pop albums. One is an album, one's a DVD that I'll order, but those will be featured in a separate unboxing blog. But I'm just babbling now. So let me just go ahead and start actually unboxing the products. So yeah. First things first. So this is a brand that I've actually been using actually for a couple of years now. And I absolutely love this brand and it's exclusively what I use. Like I said, I exclusively use uh, K-Beauty products on my skin for my skincare routine. Um, and also my own products that I make myself. Uh, like I make my own face wash, for example. But this is, um, I, th I believe it's pronounced Eliza Vecca. But um, I use their... Um, Gosh, serums. I couldn't get the word out. So uh, this is like the Hellport like serum. I absolutely love it. And then this is the Hyaluronic Acid. I don't know. Y'all know Penn's word pronunciation is not good. And excuse my hair in today's video. It's washed egg, but I clearly have not washed my hair. So, <laughs> you know, I tried to jazz it up a little bit, like, but my hair just is doesn't look good. So anyways, um, these are the first two products, like I said. So these are two serums. Um, I usually use one in the morning, one at night. This has been my daytime serum, the Hyaluronic Acid. I don't know how to actually say the word. Um, 
And then this one is the one that this previously right now is my daytime one. And then this one I haven't had in like over a year because they were out of it the last time I did an order. So these I will probably switch between my two daytime um, serums. Um, so those those first two products. And once again, whatever Pen does unboxing video, she just throws the trash on the ground like there's some sort of maid. And then I get mad after I'm done shooting the video and I have to clean up all the trash that I just threw onto the ground. So this is a new uh, serum that I got. These are Ampulase. Um, but I wanted to try these because they had two different ones. Um, and this is by a brand called Eye and Lip. So this is the uh, Peptide Dew Ampulae. And then this is the Collagen Dew Ampulae. And so I've never tried um this ampule before at all so i'm really excited to try these and this is again by a brand called i and lip beauty and the cool thing is is that you'll learn like as you get more into k beauty you'll start to learn the brands and which ones are good and which ones you know um are maybe not so good but to be honest with you pennies and pens since i've been using k beauty products i haven't come across a brand that i just really do not like um also have not come across a brand that's made me break out in any way shape or form so i've always had really really good luck which is why i do love uh k beauty products and it, it is my preferred types of products to use um when it comes to my skincare routine so this is um also by i am lip beauty this is an eggplant um baking powder uh pore scrub it's like for exfoliation and pore care and so i needed a new exfoliator because they discontinued my exfoliator that i was using from garnier um I don't know why they stopped making it. So I was like, let me get a new exfoliator. And since I was doing such a big product haul with Beauty Net Korea, I decided to add this. And then I've tried Eye and Lip Beauty products before as well. Um, I've tried a lot of their uh, sheet masks, face sheet masks. So I was interested to try this because like I said, you start to learn the brand names and all of that. And so I was like, oh, I've tried Eye and Lip before. Their products have been good to me in the past. Let me get that for that uh, eggplant uh, scrub. Uh, take a sip of water okay so what's next in here oh this is a toner and then this is by eliza vecca too but this is a toner so i decided to go ahead and try their toner as well i actually bought like so many different types of toners let's get it out and so oh i never got the other products out to show you guys what they look like either i guess i should do that too huh Ooh, they don't want me to get this one out, do they? Oh, you gotta lift this thing up. What's this thing? You see how it's like in the thing? Okay, anyways, ooh, we got we got that out of there. Okay, so this is the toner. Again, this is from Eliza Vecca. So this is from the same brand that did the uh, previous. Um, I'm just gonna go ahead and toss that box. They did previously the uh, serums that I was showing y'all. So yeah, this is the serum. Well, they call it an ample, but I call it, I'm referring to it as a serum. But you see, it's just a really nice, like clear serum. But I like it because it's, it's smooth um, and then it's not too thick and it rubs on your skin so well. And it is the perfect in between after your face wash, after your toner, um, put your uh, ample or your serum on and then your moisturizer, your skin will thank you. Your skin will love you. So this is again from Eliza Becca. That's the pore uh, serum. This is the hyaluronic acid serum I'm about to show you guys again. Or again, I mean, you know, obviously this was like from the box, but I didn't show the actual serum. So this one is like more clear. It's just straight. Like that one has, I don't know why it kind of has like the bubbles in it, but it does. But you see how that one kind of has like the bubbles in it. And then this one doesn't. But this is the hyaluronic acid. And then this is the poor one and i just i love that cute that little pig thing i don't know the the pig um mascot is quite hilarious uh they use a lot of really funny 
you know, it's just different from Western uh, brands. Uh, but yeah, and then this is the eye and lid. This is the eggplant scrub, but that's what the like bottle and stuff looks like. Okay, so just to kind of show you guys a little bit, actually do the unboxing. Oh, let's do the uh, eye and lip amples. See what those look like. Oh, this is cool. So this is in a red bottle, the collagen one. Y'all you know you always need that collagen. That collagen is what keeps skin skin looking young and fresh, honey. You know, you know, Penny only claims 22, but she's not actually quite 22. So this is the peptide one, comes in a blue bottle. I think that's really cool. But yeah. Cause I had first started using serums when I worked years ago. I worked at um whatchamacallit? Oh, I want to go through this later. It's like a little uh brochure. But years ago, I worked at uh, Estee Lauder. And so I had gotten onto that advanced night repair serum. But that advanced night repair serum is expensive, y'all. Y'all know that's like $80. Who can afford that? So switch to K Beauty, and it's much more affordable. So this is, um, oh, a toner that I got. This is also from Eye and Lip Beauty. This is the hydrate, a hydrating oasis toner. So this I will probably use at night because you need that extra moisture when you go to bed at night. It's like my face just wants to just dry up at night and it's just crazy. Okay. And then what else I got in here? Oh, and then let me go through my next toner. Yes, y'all, I got three different types of toner because I got the uh eliza becca and then the hydrating oasis from eye and lip and then this is the water calming toner this i'll probably use for the daytime and this is also by eye and lip uh beauty as well okay so then those are my toners and then what else i got in here i think these are i think these are some face washes that i got from eye and lip i told y'all i did a beauty product haul from beauty net korea that shipping is expensive even though i get everything put together through Delivered Korea, it's still expensive to even do that because you have to pay for them to condense your packages into one box and then you have to pay to get it shipped to you. So it's worth your time to get a lot of different things put into that box so that when you get it shipped to you in the US, you have a bunch of different things at once. Um, okay, and so then I got, this is the Hydrating Oasis uh, uh, Cream. This is kind of like a, a face wash cream. Oh, it helps moisturize the dry skin like a desert. So this is also by Eye and Lip Beauty. So this will be good. Um, and then this is the water calming. This is the cream. So I got the matching uh, creams with the toners. So like, for example, this is the water calming cream and then the toner. So I got the face wash and then the toner to go with it. And then same thing here, I got the um, Hydrating Oasis Cream and then the toner to go with it. So you know what I mean? Kind of like got the set to go together. And then these products I'm just trying for the first time. So I'm just trying the uh, toners for the first time and the creams for the first time. And also this toner by Eliza Beck I'm trying for the first time. Um, and then these amples. I'm trying for the first time. So I'll give like a review in a future vlog of like what I thought of them. And then I have one more product and that will be it for the Beauty and the Pen um, unboxing K-Beauty products vlog. Hope you guys enjoyed it. It's been a long time since I did a Beauty and the Pen vlog um, because the, the Penny Black YouTube channel is going to be mostly about music. I have officially decided to really hone in and focus on just doing music content. But I do want to occasionally do content like this because it is related because I never would have gotten into um, Korean beauty products if it wasn't for K-pop because I would hear like my favorite K-pop artists like being a brand ambassador for certain brands and talking about certain brands and their con content and vlogs. So I got interested in it and I was like, hey, let me check this out. And then when I saw the difference of how well K-beauty products worked on my skin, I was like switching. So the last and final product. Oh, shit. Shit, it's open. Shit. Don't you hate that? Damn it. 
It's a fucking mess too. Shit. And it's my eye cream. I am fucking so mad. You see, it's all in the box. It's all on the side. Hate that. And that's like from when they packaged it. All right, so now I really do kind of got to go ahead and just end the vlog a little abruptly because I got to kind of clean up that mess. Like, awful and gross. That was a buzzkill way to end the vlog because it's just like all open and all over the place. So anyways, thank you guys so much for watching, checking out this vlog, Beauty and the Pen unboxing k beauty products again make sure you go to my website islpdtx.com it's linked in the description box and i'll have a direct link to this t-shirt that i'm wearing so you can just click on the link go and add your size um or pick out your which size you want the shirt in and then add it to your cart and go ahead and check out little baby so you can get you uh i'm here for the crown not the prince as well hashtag queen inc and support a black and woman owned business okay so thanks for watching checking out the penny black youtube channel and supporting my business islp the ink spot llc peace